things magic exclusivity if there is one thing i really like it's having things that nobody else has and the best way to do that is to make them yourself draggies and other peculiarities let me present you the custom yubikey cover with my dragon on it now i can be paranoid in style the road to this thing was quite hefty because as you may know yubikey does sell their own coffers but they do not allow you to customize or use your own images so i had to use various kinds of tools to measure the yubikey in a sub millimeter range i had to get my own laser cutter and actually cut the stickers out because these stickers aren't made like this they were actually just square like these ones so last night i did a stream trying to cut these stickers out and also reviewing the laser cutter of course the stream is heavily cut out and edited because it's like six hours long and i didn't want to subject everyone to that torture so it just goes over the biggest hurdles and how i solved that feel free to subscribe if you like this video and of course the link to this project which is open source will be in the description below <laughs> Hey Dragon Snow Peculiarities, how did you all sleep special? Welcome to those that are new here. Today we're going to review the laser packer and I got it in this package. So I hope it's a good setup and we'll see how it goes. So yeah, let's start with unboxing. First of all, I do hope this is the laser cutter because I don't know. I it, The box says, along with like false customs declaration, that it's a CNC mill, which I didn't order, so... I assume it's the real thing. Wow! Everything is emerald! Wow! This is lovely. <laughs> so... The light hits me. All right, now let's go for the real treasures. Oh boy, look at that. The powerful laser. So I got a button for turning on and well, that's about it. It says, warning, category four laser product, avoid direct and scattered light to your eyes or skin. So yeah, this is basically the thing with laser engravers or laser cutters is that this one is not as powerful as the ones that you find in some people's garage, but thing is, it's still powerful. Like, this is not really a matter anymore of protecting your eyes. This is literally, this, this thing literally can burn you. So, you know, be careful when you use this. And we're gonna be, uh, we're gonna try to be careful with this. Oh, hey, thanks for the follow, um, Swasto, Saswato, Saswato, one, two, three. I'm just opening more boxes just to see what's in there before we continue. Okay, so this is the actual manual for the uh, instructions before use. Okay, so there's a lock on here. So you actually can avoid, um, like, children playing with this. That's great. Yeah, we got a QR code for the app. And we need a USB-C cable and a power plug. I assume that this is the separate power supply. Because... Um, these powerful lasers, they do not, you know, they, they're not going to work on like a phone battery or something. So, oh no, it's actually just a Type-C cable. Whoa, that's a fancy one. Okay, so I guess I can just plug this in my laptop then. I, um, shall we do it? Shall we uh, subject the coaster laptop to this kind of torture? I guess we will. Okay, I hope it's not going to burn. Just in case it's going to, you know, fire the laser immediately. I'm just going to put this on. Oh boy, this is so trippy. Everything is just emerald now. Okay, let's plug it in the USB port. I don't know if this is going to run, but I'm just going to use the, you know, the USB 3.0. Okay, here we go. 3, 2, 1. Okay, uh, there's a light blinking. Okay, don't burn your own cable, please. I'm just going to hang it on the dragon. Alright, so, um... Yeah. Well, not much is happening. So I guess it's time to actually link it to our phone. Damn it. This thing was so good. It turns terrible now. <laughs> Why do I need to make an account to use my own laser cutter? 
Okay, well, whatever, whatever. <coughs> we are here for fun. This is unscripted. Feminist. Yeah, why not? Okay, let's do 10 by 10. I don't know what's normal. Let's just do this. Oh, crap. Is it already starting? Shit. No, 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 no. Go back, go back. Start preview. So I guess this is showing where it's going to go. There's not, it's not burning anything yet. So it can also show the center point. That's cool. All right. So now no quick clicks. What? Okay. I guess the app is a little bit buggy and they protect themselves. So. When you mentioned to steal the account. I mean, if you want to steal the account, you literally have to have the laser. So you have to be in physical distance from here. Um, of course, I think this is a uh, recycle paper, I guess. Well, here we go. I'm going to step back a little bit. Here we go. 3 to 1. Please verify that the workspace is secure. <laughs> I really don't know. <laughs> to be honest, I... Oh, okay. I don't... Are you ready, guys? What's going to happen? Oh, it showed something in Chinese. I guess it's complaining about the height. I'll just take a first. Oh boy. Oh! Oh! Oh, that's nasty. It's actually burning. Oh god. What the fuck is that? Oh my, it's smoking in here. This is what they meant with the fan, I guess. It's 55%. Oh, this is nasty. <laughs> this is really scary. <laughs> oh, it's it's done, I guess. Okay. <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah, it burned through. <laughs> Alright, I think I did a little too small. Yeah, it actually... <laughs> it burned a hole. But, um... Yeah. It, it worked. It's just really tiny. And I burned a hole through the table. Yep. All right. Um, full set it. Yeah, but they also said that I should uh, use a fan to block the smoke, uh, prevent the smoke from blocking the laser. So just in case, we're going to do, is we're going to place this thing here. Okay. What happened to you? This worked last summer. Plan B. I'm going to put my um, my laptop in uh, heavy use mode. Because the fence will then blow the smoke away, I'm pretty sure. Just going to go to profiles and set it to power. Wham. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, I think, I think this blows hard enough now. Though, I'm not sure. But we'll see. Alright, let's try that again. So instead of like 10 millimeters, let's try 50. Okay, it's creating something. All right, it's uh, it did it. It looks a little odd. Like it seems that has some made some mistake with the data. The transition. I don't know if you can see it, but the feminist icon is a little bit. Um, strange let's try another one see how it goes okay so i'm gonna again place it here the camera so i can take a photo of something hold on a second that is something interesting not sure it's gonna happen oh oh okay okay so it's actually drawing me right now i guess it's a bit weird but it's so far it seems to be actually doing it all right. Wow. Okay, that's pretty awesome. Take a look at this. This is cool. That's me. I don't know if you can see, but it's like it's printed on money or something. So last stream we looked at the laser packer and it was kind of like, you know, trying to engrave stuff, you know, really getting into it. But now we're actually going to try to... Um, see if we can cut something with this thing. So yeah, the review continues. 
So I did this project a while ago called YubiKey stickers or custom YubiKey stickers and you got a bunch of templates that you can actually use. <laughs> Who imagines this stuff? Look at this, the moon does not have a burn mark because it's reflective, but why? Like, it's the same server, does the color really matter that much? In any case, the rest looks pretty much fine, so I'm gonna try to peel it off. See how it feels, ooh. Ooh, look at the sexy, oh yeah, baby. Yeah, we did that. Wow. So the only problem really is, is the moon. So I wonder what would happen if I would paint it black a little bit. <laughs> nice. And once again, the nerds win. We're gonna try to peel it off and put it on right. It might be a little bit off camera, but that is more because I want to make sure that I do it right, because otherwise I have to make one again. Yeah, I did it. Wow, guys, we did it. I'm gonna make a photo. Look at this. Holy moly. This is amazing! Nobody has something like this, nobody! Well, this is a, you know, permanent marker. It actually goes off pretty easily with uh, alcohol. I guess this is also because of the protective coating.